Hello summoners and summonettes, it's Gordon here, and today I'm bringing you a Sichuani jungle video. So as always, it's going to get right on into it. And we're picking up the Talisman, Refillable Pot, as well as the Warden Totem. Hi, I'm Gordon, let's have fun coming out. And let's, oh my god, they have a Master Yi 80 carry. I just realized that. That is, uh, rather interesting. We have a Victor Top, so it's just all about the interesting, interesting picks today. Oh, don't stand there. Don't stand there. They have Blitz. Oh, I'm just waiting for the hook to come fly at her face. Leaf! What the hell? They have Blitz. Alright, you deserve to get grabbed. <laughs> Why are you standing there when we literally have it warded? Alright, you're just gonna get grabbed and die. Then I'm gonna just pet my my little Sherlock. Dude, this is actually there's literally no point for standing in that bush. It's actually really dumb. I kinda gra wish she got grabbed right there. <laughs> Alright, they have a shake in the jungle, so he might invade me. And he did bring Ignite, so it looks like he's definitely trying to potentially bump some uglies with me. So I'm going to skip over my red actually. Gonna be maxing W. And uh you know, that's pretty standard. Need to go full tank this game. They have a decent mixture of damage here. Gonna go ahead and use our W as an auto attack reset there, so just throw over one regular auto attack and then slap them with a uh, W there. And we'll go ahead and save our W because it's really long cooldown, so we will just kite this little guy all the way to what would be the race here. And we'll pick up our Q level 2. Kind of unfortunate we just wasted the Krug buff on last stream of that, but it's all good. Alright, we will take this out. Accidentally slapped it a little in there, but no big deal. Alright, and we will go ahead and opt to use our second W on these just to clear these. It'll be back up and cool down just in time for us here. We'll save our Q because we want to use that to jump over the wall to blue buff here. Oh, I meant to actually save my ward and ward my red just to see if Shaco chose to counter, or not counter invade, but invade me. So he actually might have even taken my blue, we don't know, but we are YOLO checking right now, and it's up, so not sure where he's at, but hopefully he's wasting time at our red buff right now. Gonna go ahead and smite the blue, and that will give us enough mana to do whatever we please with, and touch a gank, or do a little bit more of our jungle and then go back. Alright, interrupting the auto attack there with the Q knockup, just so we save ourselves a tad bit of damage. Nice. So we're level 3 now, got all of our abilities. Can gank? I don't know how well I can assist my team though with ganks. We could maybe do it mid, but uh, he's gonna have to pop that Melzahar passive. First blood coming out, Master Yi 80 carry, not working out too well for the enemy team. Not that I expected it to. Alright, let's, let's see what we can do here. Might be able to mess with this guy. Hmm. He already pushed him in, never mind. We're actually just gonna go into Shaco's jungle and mess with them a little here. Alright, don't want to use my key just in case Shaco shows up, because then I don't have an out, so we will just uh, slap these things to death. Surprised I'm able to get a little counter drum in on the Shaco. Maybe his red's even up, but now that I actually just smited, it's probably risky to go for it. Okay, it's down. Jax's health is looking rather low here, just accidentally saw Shaco. This is really awkward. <laughs> See, he's just power farming in this jungle here. I'm just going to go back, actually. I don't really... Care to stick around too long here. Oh, I got the sniffles. Alright, let's go ahead and go boots, pink cord, as well as a hunter's potion here. I want to have a lot of accessibility to clear the jungle pretty well and get some decent vision up against the Shaco. Yeah, we'll go full tank this game. I didn't want to, but I think it makes sense too. We don't have any reason to go damage. You can easily go over Nick Echo's Sunfire. That's a really good build on Sejuani though, but. When we literally have no tank, it makes sense for me to go with this one, so. We'll have no fun and build full tank Sejuani, even though it's pretty scary. Right, I'm gonna save my W for a red buff, so again, the slow slap of death for the right here. Maxing our W, that's pretty standard no matter what build you go here on Sejuani. Alright, we will smite this up, get healthy. 
And then hopefully like the gank here. We can probably just go bottom again. I mean that's a pretty free uh Never mind. <laughs> just gonna double kill him again. Maybe. If Morana skews up. Excuse me. Choking on my own saliva. Oh, they're gonna live. Oh, she did hit it, but it doesn't matter. Kit's too low. Alright, let's see YOLO hop as well. See what we got. So these are up and available. We do have our flash in case the Shako comes to try and mess with us, but since he's dead, I've felt comfortable enough with uh, invading this here. Alright, cool. Got the counter jungle. Twice I've counter jungled him now. And might even go for the Thrice, why not? We'll pick up the uh, Gromp as well. Alright, Smite is 450. Okay. It'll take probably another auto attack. Yeah, there we go. Cool. Let's ping. Oh, shake his top apparently, so we just got his entire jungle for free there. Good. We will just finish off this little scuttle bug. And we'll see if their bot lane wants to do anything funky here. Ooh, that was a beautiful grab there. And we do have flash Q available. That is a, uh, uh, we'll go ahead and knock that guy up and kill him. Easy. But yeah, you can Q flash actually on Sejuani there. Kind of like a Gragas E flash. So that's pretty good. But uh, <laughs> we already took the entire freaking turret. What the hell? Shaka's blue is about to respawn too, so I might try and counter him with that a little bit. So I'm just going to pull the whole wave here, get rid of it, and then look to go towards that blue buff here. Oh yeah, baby. Give me that blue. Yeah, their uh, Master E 80 carry is not working out too well for them. Alright. Got smite up, so I'm definitely going to smite this, and then I'll donate our blue to either Victor or Vagar, whoever wants it, or whoever can get to it easily. Wow, that's mine. Okay. Uh, I don't think we should do dragon, but we could. I think I could just go for a kill. Okay, pop this passive, shake this mid. I'm coming to counter. So, thing to remember with Shaco is he doesn't have any flash. And if his key's on cooldown, we could easily pop him. Oh, the guy actually juked us. Oh, that Shaco's so low. That's really, really unlucky. But whatever. I mean, at least we're living. Definitely gonna stop this guy's back. There we go. Just walking up to him. This is enough threat. I wish the, uh... I guess it could have been a little more clean. I think we should have got the kill on Vigar, or on Shaco, had we just uh, immediately gone on him. I think Vigar kind of tried to save his uh, combo there. But whatever, we forced him out. It's not that big of a deal. Our right, blues up. Shaco greedy. Uh, but it's good greed because it's making him live. Oh, Master you got a kill. He's worth gold again. So there's a ward in here. I know there's a ward. I'm just going to ward over here, see if he's doing the wolves. And he is indeed. Oh, oh, we did the combo. Feels good, man. All right, got him with the combo there. I didn't know if his Q was off cooldown or not, so I tried to pop him right before he could do a deceive. It was clearly not on cooldown because it wasn't the cleanest operation of the uh, like full combo. He had time to get his actual... Deceive off there, so we got lucky with that. I don't know why Blitz just didn't pull that. He knew I was doing that. He could have pulled the uh, Grump over the wall just to reset it and make me waste time, but he's kind. Alright, we got a lot of gold. Holy moly. Let's go Tracker's Knife. Just trying to keep a track of where the Shaco is at all times here. And, oh, I hate having this amount of gold. It's so awkward. We'll just buy another Ruby Crystal. We'll turn it into something eventually. But, uh,. Wish I could have had that full Cinder Hulk completed. Would have been awesome. I should have swapped out to Oracles or Sweepings, uh, Sweeping Lens. That's my fault. Just kind of spaced on that. Yeah, we could easily take Dragon whenever. This game's kind of a uh, kind of a stomp at the moment. I do have my ult up, so definitely want to try and gank somewhere with that. But yeah, that Dragon would definitely help us be rather clean in finishing out this game. Let's go top. This guy just uses jump. He's got nowhere to go. Alright. This should be clean. Yeah, there goes his uh, counter strike. And he flashes just to get hit up by my combo. And that should be a kill here. Gonna go ahead and pop that E. Slow him a little bit more. And Victor Laser should be coming up soon. There we go. Beautiful. 
Max our Q second. That's pretty much just to put it on a lower cooldown. Let us have a little bit more CC in these fights here and do well with it. Let's go ahead and just group these up and we will take them out here with our W and our E. Uh oh, Shake -O mid. Is he making a play? Let's go ahead and counter jungle this guy even more. I never thought I would counter jungle so much on Sejuani, but somehow this guy's letting me do it. I wonder if his rates are up. No, they're not. Okay. He might actually be pathing to us right now, though. He was mid, but I don't know where he went exactly. Got some decent vision down, though. We'll go ahead and get the Scuttled Crab and probably go back for our Cinder Hulk here. And we'll clear our top side of the jungle, actually. Be efficient. And then we can focus on the bot side and get that dragon as well. So that'll be good. We will smite the Grump because we don't need vision from smiting the wolves. And we are going thanky, so that'll help us as well. Uh oh. I think Jax TP bot lane. They might have two kills there. Oh, I lied. Ha! <laughs> Are they turret diving over God and it failed or something? Oh my god, she almost killed him too. What the heck? Yo, yeah, she could kill him. Shift Thunderlords? Oh, I don't think. Okay, okay. No, she's not gonna do it. What do I want against their team? I could just go warm out. That'd be pretty trolly. Let's buy another pink ward for the Shaco because he did clear out first one we placed. Hmm. Or I could go Righteous Glory. Righteous Glory seems like a really fun item, actually. And it would give us a little bit more mana. Sejuani, so she does need at least, like, one mana item. Normally you could go, like, a Frozen Heart or something like that. Or if you get Runic Echoes, that'll give you enough mana sustain as well. So we do have that option for us. Man, we actually have decent wave play now with this Cinder Hulk. Yeah, let's get that, uh, Dragon, though. Uh, I really gotta pee! Why do I always do this? Now I'm like, thinking about using the washer more than playing the game. <laughs> Feels bad. <laughs> Alright, let's gank bottom. Our ult's up. Oh god. Is she- okay, she's dead. A little greedy by her there, being that far forward without the support of Morgana. Morgana and I can easily 2v2 these guys though. They probably have this ward, so I'm just gonna spam a taunt here. Oh, he doesn't have sidestone. I don't think they have this ward actually. Okay, they have it warded. I'm just waiting on Morgana to come closer, and then I'm going to engage on them. Alright, he's in here. Yep, he can't do anything. Alright, let's go ahead and wait for them to cluster. Or she could just uh, hit him, and then we'll chance to see that guy. Boom! You thought I forgot about you, boy! Oh, that's a Melzar. She's probably going to die, huh? Alright, I have enough damage to kill that guy, and then I can dip the hell out of here. He doesn't have alt, so I'm really not afraid of anything. I'm tanky enough to just hold on to my flash there and know that I'm not going to die for that. So, party bot lane. Four people bot lane. But, uh, we're getting out. For a two for two. Two for one. Good stuff. Shaco's going back. That means we can just take this dragon if Caitlyn wants to go to it right now. Or if Malzahar... Or if... Oh, Vagar's got no mana. Looks like we still might <laughs> try and gangbang this guy, though. He walked all the way around, I think. Did he? Yeah, he did. Uh, we could die this guy. He has no alt. Or flash, apparently. There goes his passive, and then we chain on the CC after that. Boom. And we're tanking. Beautiful. That's who we want to have tank. And now we can get mid turret, and then rotate to that dragon fire that we should have had for like a year. Alright. They can finish that. Okay, screw it. I'm, I'm not healthy enough yet, because Shake is there to get that, so... They can force onto that, finish that, and then hopefully... Oh, nice. Let's go ahead and Q flash to interrupt that guy, just so he cannot... Get some health back. Shaka's trying to come in for us. Ooh, beautiful exhaust. I'm still dead, though. His ignite's gonna kill me. Oh, what? We lived? What the fudge? Yeah, I'd like to thank the Crystal Embracer for the health regen there. Press the lift. God, if that guy wasn't so far behind, his ignite would've killed me. If he was one level higher, I would've died to that. That's actually insane. Right, let's pick up some cloth armor here. Holy shit. I have such an early righteous glory. What the heck? Alright, so they changed this item so it doesn't buff your allies anymore, but it just makes the caster, like, incredibly fast, man. Look at that movement speed. That's actually insane. Alright. Running over to the Drake here. We'll pick that up with the team. Uh, let me move that over there. There we go. And that'll be a Water Drake. 16 to 5 is the overall score. We're 404. 404 cannot be found. But, uh... Pulled off the Q flash combo twice, feels good. One of the more satisfying combos in the league to pull off. 
and this master Yi is just dead. I don't know why he's where he is, and why Blitzcrank is there as well, when they knew we just got the Drake here. Oh! Oh! I'm so hard right now. Oh, live! Okay, she lives. Dude, that was such a beautiful ult. Mmm. I love Sejuani. Alright. Bam. Bam. Got it. Sejuani ult's so fun. So awkward, though, if you miss it. One of, like, the biggest face palms in League of Legends. You're just like, ooh. You didn't see anything. Let's go ahead and throw a ward over this wall just for potential shaker. There he is. Never mind. There's Mel's hard just chilling. I'm gonna go mess with Shake on its race because I know he's there. I lied, you're dead. Is that his red? Yo, that rhymed. Where the hell did he go? Okay. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> he's just doing scuttle crab the whole time. Alright, do we mess with Mel's hard again? He doesn't have passive. But if he has all, I'm kind of scared to tower it at him. Hmm, can we mess with the jacks? I just want to fight people like all the time. I don't have flash, so it might be hard to lock this guy down, and he does have jump. So, try to predict the jump. I could have done that better. That was a bad game. I don't know why I thought he'd be a little bit faster. That was definitely my bad. I don't think we could have killed him, but definitely would have chunked the crap out of him. Alright, I play ADK like a tank. I don't think that's how you're supposed to do it. You know what? Screw it. I'm just, I'm dabbing this guy. We're popping right to score and going hand. Alright. Wait, what the hell? He's got freaking proto belt on Victor? That's scary as hell. Alright, let's go ahead and get this mid turret with the three of us here. It's just the crank, potentially Shaco as well, but Shaco's not gonna do anything to uh, stop us here. Alright, we'll pop down the, uh, the Q. Oh shit. I was gonna say, we just used our Q red for the Blitzkrieg. That was actually ballsy as hell. Another water Drake spawning, huh? Okay, okay, I see you. We need some cooldown reduction. What can we buy with armor that gives us CDR, if anything? Hmm, <laughs> and I really don't want to buy this just because I already bought Righteous Glory and that'd give me a lot of mana. But Frozen Heart against Jax is actually kind of unnecessary. So we'll get it and we'll go Ironing Boots and then we'll pick up another Cloth Armor. That's good. Now we have some decent CDR, 20%. So what is our alt cooldown now? 92 seconds, okay. All right, let's just, I'm just gonna group up with my alt and then we're gonna probably close out this game. It's looking like it might be a 20 minute surrender, but you know, you gotta you gotta take what you can get here. I, I need all the recordings I can get because I'm going on vacation for like a week, so. Ooh, one for one, enemy team comeback. Our flash is going to be up right by the time we get there as well, which will be beautiful. <laughs> oh, snap, dude. They're cleaning us up. Okay, the beat crank did die. I can clean this up. I got this. I got this. Shaco just committed. Oh, he did kill her. Yeah, I got him. I got him. I got him. We're chilling. He has no deceive yet, so I'm going to try and save my, my combo. Good. Got the freebie there. And let's see who's left. I think they all went back, which makes me sad. Hmm, can I kill this guy just by running at him? You think? Let's go and pop his passive there, and we'll try and slow him. Oh, no! I could have committed more. Okay, we can just mess up this guy, though. I don't want to ult. Screw you, Caitlyn. <laughs> I really should have ulted there. Oh, well. Alright, I still... Oh, I really want to use it. If they, if they cluster up at all, I'm going to use my ult here and see if we can pick him. Maybe the next wave they'll group up. Yeah, we'll just taunt spam a little bit. He got his passive up though, so can't really mess with him until we get rid of that, but then we can dive. Alright, there goes his passive. Okay, he flashes that. We'll just take the turret. And go! Aw, just out of range. That was like the only time I saw them cluster up. Would have been dope. Alright, as soon as Master Yi commits with an Alpha Strike, I will then answer with a Q, lock him down in the Victor W as well. He died before he even got stunned by Victor W. And that guy's probably dead, and we'll see if we can get on this guy. Commit! Ah, oh. oh, he flashes out. Lame. Shaker just, what the hell? Okay, this game was like, a stop. We got our flash up there, we got time to uh, do a combo. Oh boy, you laughing at me? Yeah. Uh. Uh -uh. I'll be a meep kid. Alright, he just wore off to safety, but uh, 
GG, I guess. That was kind of a stop, but we actually played really well. I mean, everybody played well. Or maybe the enemy team just played really poor. Oh, snap! Save my friend! Save Pratt Ryan! Give me that. Ah, oh, shit, double kill. More like double KS. Yo, give him the chip off. Ah! Okay, okay. Is that game? Oh, shit, Shaco. Shack attack! Oh, we got it with an auto attack. Alright, that should be the game. I'm gonna go back. I don't feel like dying. Oh, that was close. That was not too close, though. Oh, he's gonna kill Vigar. Vigar just died, I think. Uh, Alright, we got the AIDS. We got our frozen heart, so we're looking good now. Oh, shit! Get the turret! They're respawning. The game is so... Sh oh, he's dead. He's dead! What? Does Blitzcrank not have alt? Uh... Yo, that hurricane proc. That trap actually got Blitzcrank killed because of proc hurricane. Oh, they surrendered. <laughs> I was gonna say, you can actually clean up everybody right there, but, uh... Rip, that was a... That was fun. I got to play Sejuani. I mean, it's been a while since I've played Sejuani. So that's fun. Yo, the damage. Not too bad. We did quite a bit of damage. The Master Yi 80 carry ended up doing the most. 13 deaths? Okay, that was pretty freaking troll, but, uh... Yo. Sejuani's, like... I think she's actually a legit sleeper OP. She's not T1, but I think she's, like, T1.5 or T2. Pretty fun to pick up. Definitely a pretty good pocket pick if you want to play her and just kind of throw people off because if she gets ahead early, I think she's probably one of the best tank junglers in the game with Elite because she just is so freaking tanky. So give her a go. Let me know how you like her. And uh, if you guys like the video, go ahead and throw it a like. I'll have all my other social media such as Twitch, Twitter, and Facebook as well as when you smash reads in the info box below. And as always, guys, I'll see you all next time.